What is up guys? It is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling. Now recently WWE Shop actually had a 40% off t-shirt sale. Now I had to jump at this opportunity. Now guys, I have actually bought two t-shirts from WWE Shop. However, I got another t-shirt as a birthday present late April uh, last month from my girlfriend that I haven't actually had a chance to show you guys yet. So I'm going to be showing you that one as well in this video. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at one WWE Shop t-shirt, then the other t-shirt that I got, and then the second final WWE Shop t-shirt. I have the package right here. I'm about to rip it open. Let's get right into it. So guys, this 40% off sale. Uh, was one of them things where I literally just went onto WWE Shop just out of sheer curiosity. And I was like, okay, uh, let's get some new t-shirts. So, essentially, WWE sizes are off with me. We all know this. I did a WWE t-shirt unboxing not too long ago where I got a new Thunderdome t-shirt. Now, I got it in an XL because the large was getting a bit tight on me. Uh, so I thought, okay, we'll step up to XL. Now, before WWE messed up their t-shirt sizing, uh, I was a large. I am a large in the old style WWE t-shirts. You know, the ones that have the little authentic wear patch at the bottom. Uh, I am a large in them t-shirts, but for some reason in the ones that don't have that patch, I seem to be the large is a little tight on me. Anyway, I got that Thunderdome t-shirt and uh, I've had that t-shirt, I've had a Shawn Michaels t-shirt and I had a Roman Reigns Sharp and Wind t-shirt. I've had them since last year and uh, they're just too damn big and I I'm got sick of it. So I'm trying to sell them t-shirts. I've already sold the Roman one. I'm selling the Thunderdome one and I gave my girlfriend the Shawn Michaels one because she's a big Shawn Michaels fan. So to firstly replace the Thunderdome t-shirt, we have the exact same Thunderdome t-shirt right here in a large. Now I'm hoping that this is going to fit me a lot better than the last one did. If you haven't seen it already, uh, it's right here. It says WWE Thunderdome and on the back it says I was virtually there. Now the reason I've done this is because uh, if I ever go to a wrestling event like a WWE show, I want to get an event shirt. I like event shirts, you know, t-shirts that you get based on the event that you've been to. And uh, if you can't tell by the plaques on my wall, I'll flash a photo up on screen quickly. I've been in the Thunderdome an awful lot, and I've had very good seats in the Thunderdome, a lot of the time on hard cam. So I thought to commemorate my time in the Thunderdome, I need to get this Thunderdome t-shirt. Now, initially, I paid full price. I can't remember how much it was when I got the XL, uh, but it was over £10. Now, this, including the 40% off sale, guys, was, I think, now don't quote me on this, but I think it was £4.20. Uh, I know it was £4 something, and I might be wrong on the 20, but four quid for a WWE authentic t-shirt is absolutely insane. So I had to jump at the opportunity, and uh, let's try this one on right now in three, two, one. Here we go, Thunderdome t-shirt on me. You guys have seen it before. This time it's a large. I'm going to quickly peel off this WWE uh, holographic authenticity sticker that they put on the t-shirts now. Uh, because it is annoying. I don't like it. If I can get it, there we go. WWE Authentic sticker. Uh, just pop that in the bin right there. And uh, what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to stand you guys up so you can see what the t-shirt looks like on me. Going to give you a quick 360. Uh, this one already feels a lot more uh, like made to fit than the XL one. The XL one felt like I was wearing a dress. So let's have a look. Okay, guys, here it is. You can't see my face, really, but you're not supposed to. It's just for you guys to see the T-shirt. Now, it's quite long. I've got enough room. If I raise my hands up, it doesn't show my uh, my stomach, which is a good sign. If I quickly give you a little turn around, this is what it looks like from the side. This is what it looks like from the back. And then this is the other side. So there we go. That's the Thunderdome T-shirt. Let's get right into the one my girlfriend got me for my birthday. Okay, so my birthday, my girlfriend absolutely spoiled me rotten. Now, I would normally make a WWE haul video, but I didn't because honestly, guys, my birthday, scratch that, my birth week was hectic. It was so hectic. The day after my birthday, we actually went away for five days. So when I came back, that would have been too late. Uh, but anyway, my girlfriend absolutely spoiled me. And luckily for me, uh, this is a huge flex. She's actually a wrestling fan. Thanks to me. She actually likes wrestling, which is mental. Uh, I couldn't ask for anything better. But anyway, she got me this Apple Watch right here, which I was not expecting, which is crazy. Uh, she got me some FanDo WWE sidebars for my uh, WWE Championship 
replica belt. Uh, hopefully I can show you guys them soon. Uh, she got me uh, this WWE Drew McIntyre t-shirt, which is what we're looking at right here today. And on top of that, she didn't get me this, but uh, my family did. For my birthday, I got this Drew McIntyre A Chosen Destiny story. I will hopefully get round to reading this at some point in the near future. Uh, but, you know, I haven't read in a little while and I've got loads of other books I need to get through before I get onto this one. But yeah, Drew McIntyre book. Now, anyway, what we're here for today is the Drew McIntyre t-shirt. Now, I believe this is a relatively new t-shirt. I liked it because it's a lot more unique than other t-shirts. It's got like this charcoal gray look. Uh, it's not black, as you can see next to the Thunderdome t-shirt. They are different colors. It's got like the gold McIntyre logo uh, Drew in the middle with the big sword. On the back right here, it just has the M McIntyre logo. And it's a really cool shirt. So guys, without further ado, let's see what this one looks like on me. In three, two, one. Here's the Drew McIntyre t-shirt on me. Uh, we'll do the same as we did before. Going to quickly put you guys over there so you can see what the t-shirt looks like on me once again. Let's do it. Okay, and here we are, McIntyre t-shirt from the front. This is once again a WWE shop large. Uh, let's go to the side, the back, and the other side, and then back to the front. Here we are, McIntyre t-shirt, and that's pretty much all from that one. Without further ado, guys, let's get into my final WWE shop t-shirt. Let's go. Okay, so moving on to the final t-shirt of the video, t-shirt number three. Now, guys, as I mentioned in the beginning, I actually had to sell my Roman Reigns show up and win t-shirt, which means I no longer have a t-shirt for the top guy in the company. Now, back a couple of years ago, I would have despised myself for wanting a Roman Reigns t-shirt because I did not like the character at all. But now, here we are in 2021, and I honestly think Roman Reigns is the best thing on WWE television in general as a whole. So I needed a new Roman t-shirt, but I also wanted one that reflected the Tribal Chief gimmick because that's my favourite gimmick in WWE. The Sharp and Win t-shirt, I thought eh, it was a cool sort of Roman coming back t-shirt back when he was in the phase of turning from the big dog to the Tribal Chief. Uh, so that was cool, but it's time to get a Tribal Chief gimmick shirt. So here we are, Roman Reigns head of the table WWE t-shirt unboxing or unbagging right here. Uh, I know Roman has a new t-shirt. He's got the Stackham one, uh, and he's also got one that says Acknowledge Me. But this one was on sale, I think, I can't remember, but I think it was about £15, reduced from about 24 uh, so I had to jump at this as well. It's a really nice t-shirt. Obviously, the head of the table logo on the front. On the back, you can just see the Roman Reigns spider logo, which I don't actually know if it's a spider or not, but everyone always says the Roman Reigns spider logo. So is it a spider? Let me know in the comments down below. But once again, for the third time, this is a large. And without further ado, let's try it on in three, two, one. And here we are, the final t-shirt of the video, the Roman Reigns head of the table t-shirt. This feels really comfy, guys. Like I wouldn't even need to have to put this in the wash. I could just wear this straight up. It's so comfortable. Uh, one thing about the older WWE t-shirts, which they didn't really mention, but everyone already uh, can relate to it if you've ever had like a pre-2018 WWE t-shirt. They were all solid. They all felt like you were wearing cardboard. It's really weird uh, and quite hard to explain. But if you've had an older WWE t-shirt, you're gonna know what I mean. Anyway, these t-shirts are so soft now, these new ones. Uh, other than the fact that the sizing's a little different to how they used to be, I love these t-shirts. So, final t-shirt of the video. Without further ado, let's see what it looks like on me. And here we are, Roman Reigns head of the table t-shirt, right here, have a good look, this is it from the front, this is it from the side, the back, the other side, and back to the front. It fits me nicely, once again, it's a WWE shop large, I can raise my hands and uh, it doesn't feel like it's coming all the way up to about here, so it fits nicely. The large is definitely the best fit for me. Without further ado, let's finish this video off back at the desk. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I want to say a massive thank you to WWE Shop for doing this 40% off sale. And a massive thank you to my girlfriend for getting me everything that you did for my birthday. It was an amazing day. But there you go. 
Did you guys pick up anything in the most recent WWE shop sale? If you did, let me know what it was in the comments section down below. I will leave a link to WWE shop and WWE Euro shop in the description down below in case any of you guys want to check out some WWE merchandise yourself. Find what fits you at WWE shop. But there you go. Three t-shirts in one video, an unboxing, unbagging sort of video. I haven't done one of these in a little while, so it's felt kind of cool to sit down and do it again. I hope you guys enjoy. If you did, please be sure to give it a like, comment, and subscribe. I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Stay tuned for more wrestling content, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Ah!